Hello, welcome to the You of How To. I am Charbel and I try to make a quick, easy to follow tutorial videos walking us through some of the more popular educational technologies that are coming out. If you like anything you see in this video, make sure you click on that subscribe button, click on the bell to receive notifications uh, for videos that will be posted every Tuesday and Saturday. So let's dive right in and find out how to add audio to our Google Slides using Pear Deck. Instead of choosing uh, one of my own slides, I thought this would be a good chance to show you guys this website, slidesmania.com, okay, where there are just a ton of free templates for PowerPoint or Google Slides. And so with slidesmania.com, it will save you a lot of time. You have uh, just a ton of pre-made templates. And, you know, as a, f a husband and father of four daughters, our, our oldest is only six years old. Any chance I can get to save some time, I'm going to take it. And so um, when I want to create a decent looking slide show, Slides Mania is a great resource. So I just went to education and I chose this one. It's a weekly planner. Okay. And so uh, they usually have a description of how they feel like it can be used or what their kind of reasoning was as they created this template. And if you keep scrolling down, there are your options, right? So for PowerPoint or get Google Slides. So if I get Google Slides theme, you'll see that you first get this preview. And so you can kind of test it out, see how the links work. And if you like it, then you'll click on use template. And that will take you right into your Google Slides. Okay, and so before you can use it in Google Slides, um, because it's just this template that you've, um, it's basically been shared with you, you need to make a copy. Okay, so you first have to make your own copy, which I've done already. Okay, so this is my copy. Okay, so if you don't have Pear Deck yet, then you want to go to add-ons and get add-ons and search for Pear Deck. Okay, and so before this option uh, came up through Pear Deck to add audio to a Google slide, we would have to insert audio and it would have to be an actual pre-recorded audio file. And however you chose to record that, whether it's through a voice recorder on your phone or a web recorder. So through a browser, you can record and save files and insert audio that way. So Pear Deck has come up with an option. Um, to include audio into your slide and it's not as simple as you know an icon where you can click on it and it just plays audio and you can click again and it stops playing um, but it's still a good option here so let's go and see how it works so if we go to add-ons I have Pear Deck okay so I'm going to open Pear Deck and so the add-on shows up here on the right and so if you haven't used Pear Deck before, it essentially um, adds some very education friendly features to slides. OK, so uh, it definitely has teachers and students in mind. Uh, and so, I mean, there's just some of the things, but uh, we're not going to get into that right now. Uh, we're just going to see how we add an audio slide. So this is new. OK, so we're going to add audio to the slide and then just see how to present uh, using Pear Deck. So we click on add audio to slide and essentially a little recorder is gonna show up, but you have to realize this audio is going to play over the entire slide. So I'll just record for just a few seconds and we'll pause. Okay, and so I can either delete and start over. I can continue recording and add on or I can save what I have okay, and so I can test out what I have and I'm fine with it so we're going to add audio to the slide okay and there it is you see it here at the top right if I click on it you'll actually see that a link pops up that tells you don't change this link okay and so uh, I was really hoping and I tried uh, to turn this into 
uh, just a, a different icon that you can click on when you present. So if I just go into a regular present mode, okay, so you'll see that little image at the top right that says audio, okay, audio included, but clicking on it won't play the audio. And that's what I was ideally hope, hoping for. So to use anything with Pear Deck, you have to play it through Pear Deck. Okay, so I'm going to start my lesson. So I'm going to essentially present this through Pear Deck instead of through Google Slides. Okay, and so you have the option of student paste or instructor paste. This would be the option if you were in front of your class and you want to direct them slide by slide, you move them through each slide and, and they have their device in front of them going through with you. And you can have, uh, there's quizzes involved, they, um, there's uh, draggable um, icons, they, they can you know work with matching or sorting, there's different things they can do. And so that's great for in class. Um, so right now this is going to be our option. So we want student paste and this is going to just give us a link that we can post into Google Classroom or on our websites or in our hyperdocs and uh, our students will be taken directly to this presentation. Okay, and so uh, this is just a little bit of information for you on how you can see what's happening uh, through your dashboard. And so there's the link. Okay, so you can copy that link, paste it into Classroom or share directly to Classroom. Okay, so uh, I'm not going to do that right now. So here's the other option. You can tell students to go to joinpd.com and enter this code, HSIPG. Okay, and so uh, Peer Deck will always ask you how you're feeling today, which is very nice of them. So let's just say we're feeling great. And now we are in the slideshow. Okay, and so at the top right here, uh, you have this option to go full screen. And uh, if you do go full screen, you'll notice, so right now this is on the first slide and it says audio included. And we have this uh, like headset here. So if I was in full screen, okay, that headset isn't there really for us to click on, but the audio included uh, button is there. So uh, if you know, students looking at the slide and they see audio included, and so if we click on it, it will take us out of full screen so that we can uh, play our icon here. Okay, and so you can see that's where it is where you can play it. So I did attempt to uh, go back into my slideshow and add another audio file on the same slide and it would not let me do it. Okay, so the one audio that you record for that slide is the one and only audio for that entire slide. Okay, so just know that uh, ahead of time before you uh, use this feature. So I hope that helps you get going with adding audio to your Google Slides. Okay, so that is how you add audio to your Google Slides using Pear Deck. Uh, let me know if you try it out in the comments down below. Tell me how it worked, if you had any problems, if you if it worked well and, and you plan on using it a lot, if you hated it and think it's useless and you'll never use it again, uh, let me know down below and, and uh, if you had any problems, I'll, I'll try to help you out where I can. If you like this video, click on subscribe, click on that bell to receive notifications and I will see you in the next video.